Hello everyone, Zizenia here, and in today's tutorial I will teach you how to draw the Valknut in Affinity Designer. The Valknut is a figure coming from the Nordic mythology and is meant to commemorate the fallen warriors. Alright, so to get started we go to File New and we create a new composition. We give it 2000 by 2000 pixels in dimensions. And we click on Create. And then we go to View Guides. And we add a vertical guide to the composition. So for this figure we are going to need equilateral triangles, meaning triangles with three equal angles of 60 degrees. So the way to create equilateral triangles in Affinity Designer is to take the Polygon tool and to set the number of sides to 3. And then we set the fill to None. We leave the stroke as black. And we set the stroke width to 30 points. And then, while holding Shift, we go ahead and we create a triangle of about 800 pixels. And then we select it with the Move tool. So for this triangle we are going to need sharp angles at the corners. So the way to do this we go to the Stroke panel. And here at Align we set it to Align Stroke to Inside. And this creates the sharp angles that we need for the figure. So now that we have created the first triangle we are going to need to create two more of them. So we take the triangle with the Move tool and we center it on the vertical axis. Somewhere around here. And then in order to duplicate it we go here to Enable Transform Origin. And we set the rotation center right here, right underneath the inner extremity of the triangle, here at the top, and along the vertical axis. So it must be here. And then once we have done it we press Enter to bring out the Move Duplicate panel. We check on Duplicate and we set the numbers of copy to 2 and the rotation angle to 120 degrees and we'll click on OK. And this creates the three triangles that we need for the figure. And then we press Ctrl A to select all three triangles and we go to Layer, Expand Stroke. So what this does is that it converts the stroke object into fill objects. So now the triangles are fill only. And then we press Escape to unselect the triangles and we go here to the color panel. We set the stroke to None and we set the fill to Black. So we need to do this before we start connecting the objects with the Shape Builder tool, otherwise the program is going to add a stroke to the object. And then we press on Ctrl A to select all three triangles. We take the Shape Builder tool, we set the Action to Plus and the Clean Up to None. And then we connect these elements here, these elements here, and these three elements here. Alright, so now we have connected the figure as we need it to be. So the next step is going to be to create the gaps between the elements. So in order to do that we take the Contour tool. Here, as Contour type, we set it to Meter in order to preserve the sharp angles of the figure. And then we need to decrease the radius, so we set it to minus 7. And this creates the gaps between the elements. Alright, so that was it for this tutorial. You learned how to create the Valknut in Affinity Designer. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and learned something from it. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Affinity Designer tutorials in the future. And until then, see you next time, bye!